It's that time of year already where we all spend money on stuff. So if you're a saxophone player or you got a saxophone player in your life you want to get a gift for, this video is for you. Hey there, Jay Metcalf here. In this video, I'm going to go over some of the latest gadgets in the saxophone world because let's face it, gadgets, they make great gifts for you or for someone else. And listen, it's okay to get yourself a present every now and then. You deserve it, especially if it's for something as noble as playing the saxophone. Yeah, noble, noble's not really the right word, is it? Noble, cool. The first gift idea is not a gadget, but it comes from the sponsor for this video, which is my own website, bettersax.com. And it's my fantastic courses to help you learn how to become a better saxophone player. I think they're fantastic because I made them with a lot of love for the saxophone and music and my students, but the people who take these courses think they're fantastic because they're always telling me that they learned a lot while having a lot of fun. If you're somebody who's learned a lot while having fun taking a better sax course, give me a shout out in the comments section below. I hope somebody comments. That would look bad if nobody commented. Now, I'm not gonna go into detail on each of the courses here. There's tons more info about them. I've linked it below, but I do want to announce the beginning of my Black Friday sale that I do each year. This year, you can save 40% on any and all of the courses over at bettersax.com. Click the link below for more info or just use the coupon code SAXGIVING19 at checkout. There's also a bonus for anyone who purchases the bundle, which includes all five of my courses. In addition to saving 40%, you will get access to a live lesson with me. Uh, and if you can't be present for the live session, you'll also have access to the replay in the members area. Click the link in the description below for more info on the sale. Now let's get to the gadgets. Last year, I made a video with lots of other gift ideas. I will link it up on the screen. This year, I'm gonna focus on some newer products. So if you want even more ideas, go check out that other video. First up, we've got this new item. It's called the Spit Sponge catchy name, right? When you finish playing your saxophone, it should be pretty moist inside. Otherwise, you might be doing something wrong. Anyone who watches me on YouTube knows I'm always saying how important it is to swab out your horn with a good quality swab to get that moisture out before you put it away in the case. Problem is, uh, lots of moisture stays inside the chimneys and on the pads of the keys. So this little spit sponge thing is a washable cleaning cloth that gets inside there, removes that moisture and any other gunk and grime that might be on your pads or on your key chimneys. And if you wanna know more about why it's super important to keep your instrument clean, watch my video on saxophone lung. These things cost about seven bucks and they come in two different versions, one for saxophones, one for clarinets, flutes, and other smaller woodwinds. They make a great little gift. Uh, get a bunch for your students. Next up, we've got the key leaves. This falls into the category of things you think are stupid until you use it and then realize you can't live without it. As you can see, I use them on my saxophones. What it does is it keeps these keys that are normally stuck closed, it keeps them open so they dry out. Not having your saxophone keys stick anymore is one of those small life improvements that shouldn't really be such a big deal until you forget to put it on and your keys stick again. So annoying. They cost about 25 bucks makes a nice gift for your saxophone teacher. Next up, we got one more item from the Key Leaves Company. This is called the Gap Cap. This is a brand new item. Your saxophone came with an end plug, which is meant to first protect your octave key mechanism, which sticks out from getting damaged, but it's also there to reduce the amount of movement of your saxophone inside the case. The more snug your instrument fits in the case, the less it's gonna move around. And over a long period of time, that movement in the case can result in needing more adjustments or even you know, damage to your instrument. This gap cap is meant to do a few things. Number one, you could adjust the height of the cap, which is gonna allow you to get a more snug fit, but it's also designed to allow air to flow out that end of your saxophone. Interesting little item. If you spent a lot of money on your saxophone and wanna take the best possible care of it, 
this is something you might want to look into. Now, many of you have seen me using this odd looking saxophone harness thing. This is called the sax holder. I did videos about this in the past. I just wanted to let you know that they have come up with a new design. It's called the Sax Holder Pro. And it's basically just like the last one, but uh, with a few improvements. Number one, these shoulder braces come off uh, and I guess that's intended to help you store it away in the case. Also, when you put it on, these things lock into place. This thing that goes up and down, the part that rests on your stomach, you can also turn this and lock that in place. Other than that, what I like about the new Sax Holder Pro is that it looks a little bit less weird. I would say like, 15 to 20% less weird. Next up is the saxophone stand by Hercules. It's their travel light stand. What I like about it is it's very lightweight and it stores away inside the bell of your saxophone. It's actually very sturdy despite being so lightweight. I've been using this for the last year. I use it on all of my gigs. I also use it in the practice room. Now Hercules also makes this tall grip stand which I use to get my saxophones in shot when I'm filming my videos. You see, it's a, it's a nice big tall stand. Uh, but what I found about this is it's actually nice to just have your saxophone at uh, arm's length so you don't have to bend down to pick it up. The next item comes from my favorite saxophone company, Yanagisawa. This year, they've come out with two new products that aren't saxophones, they're accessories. The first is the Yanni Boostar, which is a heavy mess screw. You can see I've got it here on my Alta saxophone. Now, uh, I put this in the category of things that are nice to have, but you wouldn't necessarily go out and buy for yourself. Once you've got one of these things, whether it improves your sound or not, it's just nice to have that big screw on there. It just feels nice in the hand. And you know, a lot of people do notice or feel that uh, some sort of improvement in how their instrument plays. Anybody that gets one of these things, they're going to use it on their saxophone. You just got to be careful. It comes in two different versions. One uh, thread size for Yanagisawa and Selmer saxophones and another thread size for Yamaha saxophones. The next new item from Yanagisawa is their Yanni Sixes ligature for alto saxophone and clarinet. Now, if you've watched my video about ligatures, you know how I feel about them. I don't give them much credit for improving your saxophone sound, but they are kind of like jewelry for your saxophone. This is a really beautiful ligature. It also does its job very well. They're pretty expensive though, so if you do get one of these, make sure the person who's receiving it has been a good boy or girl this year. Something I've been doing a lot more lately is recording myself just playing saxophone, like in the practice room, and then posting it onto Instagram. Uh, and I just make these videos using my phone, uh, but I do use different microphones to improve the sound quality. This is the MV88 from Shure. It's super convenient because it plugs directly into the lightning port of your iPhone. Oh, look at that beautiful Better Sax phone case. But this is gonna give you a nice improvement to the overall sound quality. This one sells for $129. Now I know they've come out with a new version of this that will also work on some Android devices because it's got a USB-C plug. So you might wanna check that out depending on what phone you've got. The other mic I use is this Apogee Mic Plus. This is gonna get you a better sound quality uh, and it's got some extra features and bells and whistles on it. Uh, what's nice is you can uh, plug it into a computer via a USB cable. The downside to this is it costs more. It's like $259 on Amazon, and also it's not as portable. Now, just recording yourself with the built-in mic on your phone is fine most of the time, but if you want to improve the sound quality a bit, I strongly suggest you get one of these external microphones for your device. Okay, another new item that I've been using quite a lot this year is this wireless mic from the Cloud Vocal Company. Now I did a whole video review on this mic. So if you want to learn more about it, go check that out. Uh, what I like about this mic is the super portability of it. It's really small. The whole package fits into this small little case like this. So it's extremely convenient. And for a lot of gigs, uh, it's, it's the perfect solution. This sells for around $500. 
So it's a pretty hefty gift. And finally, the person you're getting a gift for might not even have their own saxophone. So if you're wondering which saxophone to buy as a present, I highly recommend this Jean-Paul AS400. Check out my video review to learn all the details about it. But if you want something that's very good at a very, very reasonable price, it's under $500, this is the way to go. Comes with a great case, sounds fantastic. Go watch that other video and you'll see what I mean. I hope you found this video helpful in case you had some money burning a hole in your pocket and you just didn't know what to spend it on. If you did, go ahead and click the thumbs up button and make sure you're subscribed to the channel in case you aren't already. Also follow Better Sax on Instagram and Facebook where I'm sharing tons of bonus content. Thank you so much for watching and see you again very soon in another Better Sax video.